Episode one, uh, episode three, and then we probably actually won't see him for a while. Um, if you remember, like you know, the amount that we actually saw Lilith wasn't yeah. all that often because every time you bring in a bad guy, it, it's it's it becomes like really challenging, especially if you want to create that bad guy as a truly formidable adversary. Sure. You know, because you can't have them, you can't meet up with a bad guy every week, get to know them, have, oh, yeah. have them keep losing, have the bad guy keep losing, and then it, it starts to. Yeah. Goofy, and so um, you know he'll he'll pop in. He'll he'll make um, he'll make uh, uh, you know random and, uh, appearances. And then in terms of Mark, it's actually funny because I know like you know he's on Lost and he's he's you know he's he's badass as Jacob. I mean I, I, I watch Lost, and um, and he was in the running for Castiel. Um, and it was, I, 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 you know, it was, and it, it, I, 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 I only say this to pay credit to the book, which is it was it was between Misha and Cap and and Mark. And, um, and and they were both so excellent, and, and Misha squeaked by. But, uh, <laughs> but you know, Misha, Misha just. Like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm kidding. It's a joke. Misha embodied the character, and he brought that sort of curiosity to it that that was really sort of thrilling, that kind of sort of alien curiosity. And so. Uh, but we always loved Mark, and, and he was always in the back of our heads. And so when the part of Lucifer came up, we said uh, we we went right to Mark. He never even auditioned; we just made him an offer, and he took the part. And there you go. Are you okay? I could have been Lucifer too. <laughs> yeah. Uh, do another.